Make sure that you're using a heat protectant with your hair when you're curling it so it keeps it healthy. And what I'm going to do is curl away from my face. So to start, you'll take a section from just below your ear, section that off, and take about an inch to two inches, curl it away from your face, and then you're going to roll your hair up with your fingers and pin it with a duckbill clip. This is going to hold the curl as it cools and you'll be left with really big bouncy curls. If I don't do this technique, then my curls pretty much fall out by the end of the day. But if I do this technique, then they'll even last a couple days. And my curling iron is about an inch and a half. It's pretty big. Now you'll take a section about two inches above your ear and clip the top up and you'll do the exact same thing. And as you're pinning the curls up, pin them in the direction that you curled them. So make sure you're rolling them the way that you curled them. And if you start running out of clips, just take out the ones from underneath and put those back in. Once your hair is cooled, it doesn't need to sit. When I curl, I don't like to put my ends in the curling iron and then roll it up. I like to start at my root and then as I'm twisting the curling iron, let those ends in. That way your ends aren't in the curling iron as long so it's less damaging to your hair and then you get more volume at your root. So I'm just going to continue doing the same thing all the way around. So now once you're done, you'll take all the clips out and you'll be left with these really big, really big curls. And now I'm going to go through my bangs and curl those away from my face. When I tease, I will pick up a section, spray it with hairspray, tease it with the fine tooth comb hold it with the blow dryer, and then blow dry it. You don't have to do all those steps, but if you do, your hair will last forever and you'll love it. Now just comb it out with your fingers and a little bit with the comb if you want. Now I'm spraying it with some dry wax spray, and this will give you a little messier look. I'm just going to take a bobby pin and pin it right behind my ear. And just a little hairspray and you're finished.